BMW R12. We're launching this bike on the Saturday. What a great little cruiser. Finally, we've got something to go at um, in the heritage market, a little bit smaller than the R18. For those of you that haven't already seen my R9T video, the R12 R9T, done another video on this one. This one's a similar bike, but it's very much a cruiser image on this bike. We've got the same suspension, but the whole bike is nice and low. So around to the front of the bike, we've got that lowered suspension on the front there. We've still got the nice interactive headlamp on there. This one's got the classic dial on it on there does have some Bluetooth connectivity. We'll walk on to the SP Connect uh, system that's mounted on this bike. I've got my phone on here. We're gonna show you some really cool features on that as well. So here we go, guys. We're gonna have a look at a little bit of technology on the front of this bike here. Um, it's got an SP Connect mount. So this is the, uh, the general mount for a general phone. If like me, you already run the SP Connect system, you'll see here I've got a nice, really sleek little case that clips straight onto the system. Anti-vibration damper as well. We'll show you a little shot of that. And then we'll show you now, cool little feature. We've got some lean angle stuff going on here. It really works really well. The speed of the app is incredible as well. It's like live time, there's no delay at all. It's absolutely fantastic. And we've got the little whirly wheel, fully takes over the phone. So let's delve in and have a little look on this uh, device here. So here we go, guys. Um, I've hooked up to the uh, Bluetooth now um, on the bike. That works through the BMW Connected Ride app. That's free um, for, for all BMW users anyway. You'll see the R12 is already on here as we speak. Um, so this is the original mount. I've got the nice little case here. So simply, all we're gonna do, uh, line up the slots, pop it down and twist. It's as easy as that. We've now got a dash view to look at and uh, we'll go through this with you. We're in on the maps, so you can see here straight away. Uh, we've got the mapping uh, system here. Uh, this is the really cool little device that we've got just here. So it's a lean angle on there. We can increase the size of that. And you'll see as I lean the bike, we've got live lean angles going on there. So over to 15 degrees that side. How cool is that, guys? We can bring that back off again, uh, come back out through the app. And uh, let's just have a go down through the menu here. Uh, so we'll come back out of there. And then we've got uh, your connectivity hub, you've got your routes on there, and then you've got your mapping device just there. So really cool, works just like a, a full TFT screen, using this lovely, easy to click on and off device just there, absolutely superb. Um, different shaped tank to the R9T, so already starting to sort of differentiate the two models in this R12 range of bikes. Um, beautiful Aventurine red metallic uh, is an upgrade on there. Price is starting shade under 12 grand uh, for this bike. Um, really, really good value when you look at the competition. Um, and when you come and sit on it, you'll feel the real quality um, that this bike has. It's got some real, really nice feel about it. The foot forward slightly positioned compared to the R90 again. Lots of little, nice, subtle differences. Light signature's different. And overall, just beautiful technology put together on a really nice heritage base. Looking forward to getting you in here on the Saturday to have a ride on this bike um, and really start to boost the uh, heritage brand that we're now building up at uh, BMW Motorrad. Come down and see me. This bike will be the demo bike. We'll have another bike here as well, the full 719 option bike. That's a little bit special. Looking forward to showing you that one as well, making life a ride.